So this is my aerator. Aerating season is getting ready to come upon us and put down some grass seed. And I have to modify this bracket. This right here was here. So I cut it off and it needs to be heat welded onto here. And here, I don't know why this bracket from Jericho did not work, but it doesn't. And instead of modifying my other bracket for my other lawnmower, I'm just gonna go ahead and make this the way it's supposed to be so I can switch between the two mowers so I can aerate with either one of them. Okay, so I got a makeshift uh, set up here just to make sure everything works. Got it hooked up to power. Here's my switch. My co power cords run down here to this aerator. So, my switch, my aerator, Operating everything all right. So now all I gotta do is make sure I put this on the way I want it. And I'm gonna use like little Velcro straps so I can take it off if I need to use my other machine there and do a quick change. So, I will continue this video once I have my, my piece and I can hook it up. Well, I got my bracket back from the welding shop, Amish welding shop. Um, it definitely took a bit of more time, which I don't know why. It, <clears throat> about a hmm almost two weeks when they had told me the following week I had checked to make sure that the aerator would fit in here and it was great what I didn't check is to see if they well put these brackets on properly as you can see it's welded but they welded it backwards because here I put on here T-O-P, top, top, meaning for this bracket to go in here, it would go like this So, because everything is cut. These are upside down. <laughs> so the way they welded it, it's way, way off so now i have to modify this so it can go in this is why i always try to do things myself because when i leave it to others they never do the damn shit right and it cost me an arm and a leg which was like a sticker shock <laughs> all right let's get busy So I'll touch up what has been welded. So I don't get any rust. So I just end up cutting this side off, get it on there. You can see lined up pretty well. We should be good to go. 
Here's a little snapshot of the trailer. Got the stand on with the bracket on. Got my sit down with the aerator on it. Little Let's Go broadcast spreader. My Scott drop feeder. Little echo blower. This is the setup. And go out and make make a little moolah. Out here doing a little flagging of the irrigation so we can aerate so we do not hit the sprinkler heads. 